Okay, okay, let's head over to Chef Mark, who's got the legend Sean Connolly this morning with him. How are you, boys? <laughs> Yeah, very good. Good morning. good morning. Welcome, Sean. Welcome to the kitchen. It's great. Thank We've you. got Sean in the kitchen today, and we're going to do a sweet treat. So it looks fantastic. So what are we making today? We're going to do a cobbler pie uh, with blackberry and apples. Awesome. Like one of my favourite uh, combinations there in desserts. Yeah. Blackberry, apple, and a cobbler. That's Ooh, right, yeah. Love a good cobbler. We're doing our love. Yeah, I love a good pie. And right now it's the pie awards tonight. That's why I'm here. So that's why we're doing the pie. Celebrating it's awesome. a great pie. And because I did it last year. Mm -hmm. And so did you get to try lots of pies? I did. I did about 25 pies Is that uh, it? on Thursday. Yeah, it was I, I about had 200. Did you? Yeah. I had like <laughs> stun doubles going in eating for me first. And I just went and tasted the best of them at the and end. And some good pies this year? Oh, some awesome pies. I was really, really impressed with it. The, uh, the skill of the pie makers and also the level of judging as well. The judges are amazing. They've all got like 25 years as oh, bakers definitely. and pie makers. So I learned a lot about pies that day. Oh, it's, it's fantastic. Good. Right, come back a bit later on this show. We're going to talk about pies and make this beautiful, sweet treat. Now it's back to Mel. Well, we are joined in the kitchen by a big fan of the humble pie, Sean Connolly. How are you, Sean? Good, thank you. Thanks for having me again. Oh, it's Beautiful. good to see you. Yeah. <laughs> and the pie awards a couple of nights ago. Geez, that must have been a tough job, judging all those pies. You, you're, you're, you love your pies, though, don't you? I, I'm, I am fond of pies and we do a lot of pies in my restaurants from right. rabbit pie, lobster pie, duck and foie gras pie. So yeah, I am a bit of a pie uh, pie judge. Is it, an, is it a Yorkshireman? Of course he's a pie, pie, pie <laughs> fiend. I'm a pie freak. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we'll talk about the pie awards as we get cracking with yep. this. So you're making a cobbler pie and we excuse are. my ignorance, what, what do you mean when you say a cobbler pie? Well, it's just a cobbler crust. It's kind of, uh, it's a very delicate kind of sweet short crust pastry. Right. And it's just the, it's added added kind of delicacy when you add a lot of cream to it as mm, well. Mm. It's just very, very short. Almost like a shortbread, if you oh, like. Yeah, my okay, yeah. well, sounds delicious. Right, well, let's crack into it. So what have we got, Mark, doing there? He's scraping the well, old Mark's vanilla pods. Mark's scraping the old vanilla pods there. We're going to uh, put some butter in here yep. and uh, melt down. We're going to cook our, our apples mm. nice and gently. Nice. How's life anyway? Around. Are you yeah, good? You busy? It's good. It's nice and busy, yeah. yeah. I'm just about to open a restaurant in Dubai in... Uh, about four or five weeks, so oh, I'm a bit good. nervous at the moment. Oh, you'll be fine, mate. <laughs> we watched you open this one here. We watched you open the grill here. Oh, I love oh. that TV show. It was good fun. That was a lot of fun, that yeah, show. Yeah, it was. Tell you. Geez, I learned the stress of opening up a business. But you're a man that likes to make decisions and stick with them, so I'm sure you'll be fine. <laughs> Speaking of decisions, yes. you had to decide who was the overall winner. Remind us again, what sort of pie won the Bakel Supreme Pie Award? Do you know what it was? It was. It was actually uh, a venison oh, pie nice. with yes. cheese and bacon. Mm. And it was, it was a fascinating and fresh bakery. Yes, you're right, and total. So good. Yeah, so powerful. well done. That's right, um, yeah. did, you, did you get to taste that one yourself? I did. You know what? It was really beautiful, and I, I got to taste the last 11, 11 uh, pies, and uh, I was really, really surprised at how moist the venison was, because you know what venison's like? It's super oh, yeah, lean. Yeah, and it's yeah, super hard to cook as well, especially wow. in the pie. It's a bit tricky. I was, yeah. I was like, this guy knows his onions. He knows right. how to cook. <laughs> <laughs> and a great story, too, because he's originally from Cambodia. He came here 12 years ago. He worked two years at a at a bakery and then he bought one and basically just took all the knowledge he learnt in two years and now makes winning pies. So congratulations. So good. Yeah, and I'm off to Topol this weekend, so oh, I'm going to yeah? call in and get a pie. I've been some pie. all my friends to go down there. Yeah, I'm telling nice. you. <laughs> okay, so what did you put on the mixer there, Mark? Right, so I'm just going to cream the butter now. So we're just, we're just getting it um, so nice and smooth. Uh, it's starting to get fluffy and then we can start adding the rest of the ingredients. I'm going to put the sugar in next. Yum. And then we'll uh, sieve the flour in. Okay, so it's come more often, mate. You are a legend. You help me out big time. Thank know, you. Good. I yeah. love him. I like it <laughs> with other people here too because it's usually me doing the hard work. All right. <laughs> He's turning me into a sushi. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you put some orange. Nice orange zest in there. Yep. We're just cooking down the apples nice and gently. Mm, I can smell that. You're still, that. still going to want a little bit of texture in there, don't we? We do. We so do. just starting to soften. Just what, have, have a little bit of texture. And then when what, what stage are you going to put the blackberries in? Well, once they, t they, uh, they soften nicely, we're going to put the blackberries in. So mm. I, I don't want to lose the shape of the blackberries, but the apples are going to suck up all that beautiful purple oh, nice flavour. Yeah. That's what she was thinking about. It. Oh, I know. Well, I can <laughs> smell it. This is incredible. So you're yeah. keeping the vanilla pods in there. I'm just you throwing scrape them, but you keep them in yeah, there. Yeah, scrape them, put them in. All the, as much flavour as possible. We'll put right. them out later on. Give okay, them a cool. toss. Yeah, yeah, don't put the cinnamon stick in the pie. Right, no, take no. it out. Yeah. <laughs> It'll be a bit of a hit, I'm sure. Um, OK, now, Bakel's Supreme Pie Awards. Uh, you know, we know who the winner was, but one of my favourites, Bacon and Egg. Do you, can you remember who won that? Patrick Lamb. Patrick Lamb. What a legend. He Didn't he win it last year, I, I think? I think he might yes. have. Yeah, no, he was he the winner have. last year, yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's how good the bacon and egg pie was. And it's really interesting, because we cut the pies cold, and we hand them round, and everyone inspects them. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, there's not enough filling in there. Like, right. it, it seems to be a big gap. 
Um, and once they baked it, it it's amazing. Fills kind of up. fluffed up. It was really wonderful. Oh. Uh, it was an experience for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, Max, so what are you doing now? So I've just uh, so creamed the sugar yep. and the butter. Yeah. So I've just sieved the flour in, just going to mix that through. Okay. And then we're going to put the cream in the last minute. Okay, great. Well, I'll tell you what, we can come back, see the second part of this in just a minute. Humble cobbler pie, I guess we like to call it. Smelling fantastic. Okay, so what have Thank you been you. doing? Well, we've been, we've been gas bagging. So the apples have softened nicely and we've put in the uh, blackberries and you can see now they're starting to go really beautiful and mm. deep kind of purple mm. yeah, the band yeah. um, <laughs> gonna, and then uh, and then Mark I've got you've got the dubious task of putting the cobbler crust into that pie which is quite delicate yeah thanks, not an mate. easy crust to put on um, it's very very short but good luck with that especially in these heats yes, it's, it heated nice, yeah, yeah, it's getting yeah. a bit warm come on Leggy come on Oh, good lad. Oh, look so, at that. What's the worst thing that can go wrong with the oh pie? You reckon? Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Just give it a rinse. <laughs> yeah. What's, what's the thing that can go wrong with the pie? What's, oh. what's your worst thing? Well, I think you've got to... It's the pastry, isn't it? I mean, a good pie, it's, is, it's all about the pastry. So soggy you bottom? To... I hate a soggy bottom. Yeah, same. <laughs> 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 like them a bit burnt. Um, <laughs> um, no, OK, so, but that, so no pressure, Mark. That could easily happen. He's done a good job there. Look at that. Okay. Actually, you should get a round of applause, say, really. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, round of applause. There you go. Mark. Round of applause for Mark. <laughs> Well, that's and a that pretty <laughs> pathetic round of applause. But we'll oh, <laughs> Jesus. We'll just wait until you've got to lattice in. the top. Yeah, that's right. right. can of clap. Okay, what um, did you just sprinkle in there? <laughs> so I've got some <laughs> flour and water. I made a drizzle. Yeah. Just put it in there to thicken it up so we've okay. got a nice pie sauce. So, yeah, so that's going to help not make a really soggy base. That's right. right. Just thicken it. You know, it's going to be nice and moist when you cut bit into it. And beautiful. Flour. Yeah. Stop your bum getting soggy. Right. So a bit like <laughs> yeah. gravy, really, isn't it? <laughs> gravy for your cobbler right. pie. You actually got your first chef set with a cobbler pie, or a pie, didn't you? I did, yeah. You know what? It was uh, a duck and foie gras pie. I got my first hat, yeah. Very nice. good. I've, I've fond memories of that pie. How old were you when you did that? Oh, gosh. I don't know. 30-something. <laughs> oh, grief. Yes. Okay, cool. So, Last I'm, year. Yeah. <laughs> so, I don't... Stop sucking up. <laughs> <laughs> so, obviously, I don't want to put hot mix into a, a cold pie. No. So, what I've done for Mark is I've made a pre, a pre made this nice and cold this morning for <laughs> it's you, mate. to so, stitch me so up. So, I want it to be a success <laughs> today. All right, so we might just pop the filling okay, in. Okay, so you've definitely got to cool it down before you put the filling in. You have Yeah, you have to. Otherwise, it's, you know, you're going to bring the temperature of the pastry up, all the right. product's going to come out, and it's just going to be a right mess. Okay, great. And I like to fill my pie up as much yeah. as possible. That looks so good. It Vibrant looks colours, good, doesn't it? Too, yeah, doesn't it looks good. Yeah. Lovely. Right, so, and, th and this is the fun part now. <laughs> <laughs> it is a bit fun because we've got to make the lattice right. And I'm all fingers and thumbs. I'm not very dexterous when it comes to doing this, but we'll give it a go, shall we? <laughs> we get Mike to do it. What yeah. did you call it? The what? The lattice. The lattice work. The lattice. So we're going to put these strips across the oh, pie. I thought we were putting, like, green leaves over the top. <laughs> well, that's lettuce, not lattice. Ah, the lattice, yeah. <laughs> okay, <laughs> right. OK, cool. Well, let's watch the pro do this. All right. <laughs> I haven't got to do what I'm doing. The, uh, <laughs> so we're just going to lay it across like so. I put a couple across first. We just need to lightly pop it on at the moment because then we're, we're going to run it like going across, so it's all going to be cross, but it's going to go under and over and under and over and then side oh, under and over. I see. Yeah. So, and then if you do it right, it looks fantastic. Yeah. But if you don't do it right, it just looks like a dog's dinner. <laughs> yes. So, no pressure. <laughs> no pressure. <laughs> Mate, get stuck in, don't you? Yeah, that's <laughs> right. Yeah, she's yeah, yeah. <laughs> Okay, it's so very delicate in, as well. While, while we're watching you do this, if we're ever in Sydney or we're ever in Australia, because you've got restaurants all over the place, I, where should we come I and visit? I'm very again? lucky, yeah. No, I've, so I've got the Morrison in Sydney. Yep. It's one block behind the Hop Opera House on George Street. Oh, nice. Yeah, good. Um, and then we've got the balcony at Byron Bay, which yep. is a beautiful kind of coastal brasserie, serves amazing oysters there. And then I've got a really cool restaurant called um, Sean's Kitchen in Adelaide. Okay, nice. You're there doing you a top job there, Geezer. But <laughs> again, one I, here's one I prepared earlier. Yeah. Like, <laughs> come on. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> he's got one he's prepared early. I love this. So you just go... Oh, thank you God for it. that. You pleat it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. <gasps> oh, here it is. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> oh, oh look wow. at that. See, that's it. <laughs> Mate. Oh, I just, I just, I'm going to stop <laughs> right here. <laughs> 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 that is legendary. Thank you, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> Pie of Lords. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> look at that. Well, we can judge this one. <laughs> it's a presentation. Yum. Okay. All right, let's take it over and, uh, yeah, and get the verdict. <laughs> nice work. Oh, yeah. Oh, it looks delicious. It's Mel you've got to impress. Yeah. <laughs>